This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Well, well, around this time, Jerry Lawler buys out Jerry Jarrett for his half of the USWA. What do you remember about this? And did you remember talking to the King about this while this was all going on? Well, Jerry just wanted to run his territory. You know, he wanted to still, uh, keep in, be in charge and create, uh, the storylines, keep himself on top for USWA. Uh, it's his company, his baby. So, uh, yeah, we talked about stuff like that all the time. I. I never understood, you know, he didn't have a great infrastructure down there, did Jerry. Mm. So what do you mean? He didn't have the people, he didn't have the background, he didn't right. have the staff. You see what I'm saying? Yes. He didn't have the staff that, uh, that, that, that what Vince had the infrastructure. So, uh, and I just thought Jerry was putting too much pressure on himself to, to, uh, in, in this particular time, but in any event, that's what he wanted to do. And, you know, the WWF is always, uh, Vince is always a has always been a big proponent of Lawler's seems to me like they've always, they work well together. So, uh, in any event, that's, that's kind of where we were. They, they, we just, uh, we just had a, we we're trying every, everything was being thrown against the wall, Paul, to see what was going to stick. Yeah. Talents, tag teams, whatever it may be. Uh, and some of those ideas are really good. And some of those ideas were really bad. Since we're here, I have to ask, did you ever personally work at all with Jerry Jarrett, longtime promoter? You know, uh, I worked around him when he came to work for Vince and he was doing some administrative work. Uh, when old Jan and I had had him over for dinner a time or two, mm. uh, while he was working there, home cooked meals, always nice. And she was a fabulous cook. So, uh, but I didn't work with him a lot. Okay. He was a lot like working with a cowboy. I mean, they had the same philosophies. So, uh, no, I, I, and he knew a lot about wrestling. He was a good wrestling guy. <laughs> so I'm not sure, uh, what else goes along with all this stuff with Jarrett, but I didn't have any issues with him. Uh, and, uh, he was a smart guy, but he was in one of those, uh, rabbit hole type things there with, uh, in his role, uh, it was going to be tough for him. Hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.